Wubble wubble dub dub bitches! It is Chris Riser Die, and today I have the Alien Morty and Alien Rick pop figures um, from Rick and Morty. Uh, these guys are pretty cool. Um, super pumped when I got these. I actually had to uh, get these from Hot Topic online. They are a uh, 2000 Spring Convention uh, exclusive, so you had to get these at the Comic Con, or if you're lucky enough uh, to stay up to 3 a.m. on HotTopic.com and actually able to order them offline. They came pretty quick, so pretty pumped. Um, so you'll see here, I got them already out of the boxes. Um, I'm gonna put them back in, but I just wanted to take them out to show everybody uh, how cool these things are. So if you just kinda look at the, the detail on these things, not a lot of it, <laughs> that's the point. Um, so I mean, Funko Pop is pretty simplistic, but um, I think these look better than the, um, the glow in the dark ones that I got the other day for um, the the Toxic Rick and Toxic Morty. I think the paint job's on them better as well. Um, these ones, though, do not come with a stand um, or a little hole in the feet to stand them up. Um, they're top-heavy just like the glow-in-the-dark ones, but um, they don't come with a stand at all. Um, and here's uh, Rick for you. Uh, I mean, they, they're done pretty well. Um, super cool. I'm a little upset with the paint. You can kind of see how there, how like the, the paint just doesn't line up all the way. You need a little scratch on the eyebrow. Those came from out of the box, but really cool. Details done pretty well on this one, though. You can kind of see how the antennas are put, to, oh, put, put together there. Scratched up, but I um, mean, you got the elf ears, the antenna, the third eye, the, the four hands, and you got his bald spot back there. Um, this one. Doesn't have a hole in the foot either for a stand, but um, yeah, I mean, they're, they're pretty cool looking. Um, they're going to be hard to find. I mean, good luck finding them at Hot Topic, but um, either you're going to get them at the, the Comic Con or you're getting them at Hot Topic themselves. Um, it, it, now, I'm a huge Rick and Morty fan, um, and I had no idea who Alien Rick and Alien Morty were. I don't remember them ever being in an episode. Um, I did look it up. It turns out they were just in the background of uh, the Rick Shank Redemption. Um, I believe they were also in the Close Encounters of the Rick Kind, uh, just in the background of the Citadel and things like that. You know, there's a million universes and a million Rick and Mortys, and these are just two of them. So they're pretty, uh, pretty kind of offhand, but you don't really recognize them or know about them, which kind of makes them, I guess, cooler and rarer. So uh, hopefully they'll be worth a little more. But I just kind of want to get them out of the box and show you. So here's the Morty box, number 338. Now, I also got the uh, Rick Facehugger one. I got that from GameStop. I got to actually got that the other day. I was able to kind of come across that in the store, which is pretty cool. Um, so this is the other wave of um, pop figures. I know the Sentinel Arm Morty uh, actually has a Chase variant um, that has blood on it, which is pretty cool. That's hard to find, too. Um, so, yeah, there's the box for Alien Morty. And then over here, we do got Alien Rick. Kind of same premise. Number 337. And the same backing. So, pretty cool. Um, you'll know that I got these from Hot Topic because it has this right here. Um, if you actually got it from a Comic-Con, it has a different sticker. But, um, nonetheless, there's a sticker there, so they are rare. Um, so, there they are, Rick and Morty. My uh, oh, favorite show in a while. So now I, I did hear that season four hasn't been ordered yet, which is kind of disappointing because I was hoping to see it much sooner than later because it's been like two years between, you know, uh, seasons. But yeah, here they are. So they'll keep teasing us with Rick and Morty toys and shirts and everything else, and I'll keep buying them. Um, so guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, please give me a subscribe. The little icon down there on the bottom right here in the corner. Uh, you can also follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Chris Rise I appreciate you watching. Thanks.